In the gravitational two-body problem, the specific orbital energy e display style epsilon or vis viva energy of two orbiting bodies is the constant sum of their mutual potential energy ep display style epsilon underscore p and the total kinetic energy ek display style epsilon underscore k divided by the reduced mass According to the orbital energy conservation equation also referred to as vis viva equation, it does not vary with time, E equals EK plus EP equals V22 minus mu R equals minus 1 2 mu 2 H2 1 minus E2 equals minus mu 2 A display style begin aligned epsilon and equals epsilon underscore k plus epsilon underscore p and equals frac v carrot 2 2 frac mu r equals frac 1 2 frac mu carrot 2 h carrot 2 left 1 e carrot 2 right equals frac mu 2 a end aligned where v display style v is the relative orbital speed r display style r is the orbital distance between the bodies mu equals g m1 plus m2 display style mu equals g m underscore 1 plus m underscore 2 is the sum of the standard gravitational parameters of the bodies. H display style H is the specific relative angular momentum in the sense of relative angular momentum divided by the reduced mass. E display style E is the orbital eccentricity. A display style A is the semi-major axis. It is expressed in J per kilogram. Topic. M2 is minus 2 or megajoule per kilogram. Kilometer 2 is minus 2. For an elliptic orbit, the specific orbital energy is the negative of the additional energy required to accelerate a mass of 1 kilogram to escape velocity parabolic orbit. For a hyperbolic orbit, it is equal to the excess energy compared to that of a parabolic orbit. In this case the specific orbital energy is also referred to as characteristic energy. Topic: <inaudible> Equation forms for different orbits. For an elliptic orbit, the specific orbital energy equation when combined with conservation of specific angular momentum at one of the orbit's apsides simplifies to E equals Minus mu two a display style epsilon equals frac mu two a, where mu equals g m one plus m two display style mu equals g left m underscore one plus m underscore two right is the standard gravitational parameter a display style a is semi major axis of the orbit proof for an elliptic orbit with specific angular momentum h given by h 2 equals mu p equals mu 1 minus E two display style h carrot two equals mu p equals mu at left one e carrot two right. We use the general form of the specific orbital energy equation. E equals v two two minus mu r display style epsilon equals frac v caret 2 2 frac mu r with the relation that the relative velocity at periapsis is v p 2 equals h 2 r p 2 equals h 2 Two one minus E two equals new one minus E two two.
2 1 minus e 2 equals mu 1 minus e 2 up 1 minus e 2 Display style v underscore p carrot two equals h carrot two over r underscore p carrot two equals h carrot two over a carrot two one e carrot two equals mu at left one e carrot two right over a carrot two one e carrot two equals mu left one e carrot two right over a one e carrot two. Thus, our specific orbital energy equation becomes e equals mu. One minus e two two one minus e two minus one one minus e equals mu up one minus e one plus E two one minus E two minus one one minus E equals mu one plus E two one minus E minus two two one minus E equals mu A E minus one two one minus E Display style epsilon equals mu over a left one e carrot two over two one e carrot two one over one e right equals mu over a left one e one plus e over two one e carrot two one over one e right equals mu over a left one plus e over two one e two over two one e right equals mu over a left e one over two one e right. And finally, with the last simplification, we obtain. E equals minus mu two display style epsilon equals mu over two a for a parabolic orbit. This equation simplifies to E equals zero display style epsilon equals zero for a hyperbolic trajectory. This specific orbital energy is either given by E equals mu 2 a display style epsilon equals mu over 2 a or the same as for an ellipse depending on the convention for the sine of a in this case the specific orbital energy is also referred to as characteristic energy or c 3 display style c underscore 3 and is equal to the excess specific energy compared to that for a parabolic orbit. It is related to the hyperbolic excess velocity v infinity display style v underscore inf t the orbital velocity at infinity by 2 e equals c 3 equals v infinity 2 display style 2 epsilon equals c underscore 3 equals v underscore inf t caret 2 it is relevant for interplanetary missions thus if orbital position vector r display style math bf r and orbital velocity vector v display style math bf v are known at one position and mu display style mu 
is known, then the energy can be computed and from that, for any other position, the orbital speed. <laughs> Rate of change For an elliptic orbit the rate of change of the specific orbital energy with respect to a change in the semi-major axis is mu 2 a 2 display style frac mu 2 a caret 2 where mu equals g m 1 plus m 2 Display style mu equals g m underscore one plus m underscore two is the standard gravitational parameter. A display style a is semi-major axis of the orbit. In the case of circular orbits, this rate is one half of the gravitation at the orbit. This corresponds to the fact that for such orbits the total energy is one half of the potential energy, because the kinetic energy is minus one half of the potential energy. Topic: <laughs> Additional energy. If the central body has radius r, then the additional specific energy of an elliptic orbit compared to being stationary at the surface is minus mu 2 a plus mu r equals mu 2 a minus r 2 a r Display style frac mu two a plus frac mu r equals frac mu two a r two r. The quantity two a minus r display style two a r is the height the ellipse extends above the surface plus the periapsis distance, the distance the ellipse extends beyond the center of the Earth. For the Earth and Display style just little more than r. Display style r. The additional specific energy is g r two. Display style g r two, which is the kinetic energy of the horizontal component of the velocity, i.e. v two two equals g r 2 display style frac v caret 2 2 equals frac g r 2 v equals g r display style v equals sqrt g r topic examples topic ISS The International Space Station has an orbital period of 91.74 minutes 5504s hence the semi-major axis is 6738 kilometers The energy is minus 29.6 megajoules per kilogram the potential energy is minus 59.2 megajoules per kilogram and the kinetic energy 29.6 megajoules per kilogram compare with the potential energy at the surface which is minus 62.6 megajoules per kilogram the extra potential energy is 3.4 megajoules per kilogram the total extra energy is 33.0 megajoules per kilogram the average speed is 7.7 .7 km per second, the net delta V to reach this orbit is 8.1 km per second, the actual delta V is typically 1.5 to 2.0 km per second more for atmospheric drag and gravity drag. The increase per meter would be 4.4 J per kilogram, this rate corresponds to one half of the local gravity of 8.8 .8 m per square second. For an altitude of 100 km radius is 6,471 km 
The energy is minus 30.8 MJ per kilogram, the potential energy is minus 61.6 MJ per kilogram, and the kinetic energy 30.8 MJ per kilogram. Compare with the potential energy at the surface, which is minus 62.6 MJ per kilogram. The extra potential energy is 1.0 MJ per kilogram, the total extra energy is 31.8 MJ per kilogram. The increase per meter would be 4.8 J per kilogram, this rate corresponds to one half of the local gravity of 9.5 m per square second. The speed is 7.8 km per second, the net delta V to reach this orbit is 8.0 km per second. Taking into account the rotation of the Earth, the delta V is up to 0.46 km per second less starting at the equator and going east or more if going west. Voyager 1 For Voyager 1, with respect to the Sun, mu equals g m display style mu equals g m equals 132,712,440,018 billion seven hundred and twelve million four hundred and forty thousand and eighteen kilometers threes minus two is the standard gravitational parameter of the Sun. R equals 17 billion kilometers. V equals 17. 1 kilometer. Shents. E equals. E k. Plus. E p. Equals. V. 2. 2. Minus. Mu. R. Display style epsilon equals epsilon underscore k plus epsilon underscore p equals frac v carrot two two frac mu r. Topic one hundred and forty six kilometers twos minus two minus eight kilometers twos minus two. One one hundred and thirty eight kilometers twos minus two, thus the hyperbolic excess velocity, the theoretical orbital velocity at infinity, is given by V infinity equals display style V underscore inf t equals sixteen point six kilometers. Show over Voyager one does not have enough velocity to leave the Milky Way. The computed speed applies far away from the Sun, but at such a position that the potential energy with respect to the Milky Way as a whole has changed negligibly, and only if there is no strong interaction with celestial bodies other than the Sun. <laughs> <laughs> Applying thrust Assume a is the acceleration due to thrust, the time rate at which delta v is spent. G is the gravitational field strength. V is the velocity of the rocket. Then the time rate of change of the specific energy of the rocket is v. Display style math bf v c d o t math bf a. An amount v a minus g. Display style math bf v c d o t math bf a math bf g for the kinetic energy and an amount v g display style math bf v c d o t math bf g for the potential energy. The change of the specific energy of the rocket per unit change of delta v is v a a Display style frac math bf v c d o t a math bf a, which is v times the cosine of the angle between v and a. Thus, when applying delta v to increase specific orbital energy, this is done most efficiently if a is applied in the direction of v, and when v is large. If the angle between v and g is obtuse, for example in a launch and in a transfer to a higher orbit, this means applying the delta v as early as possible and at full capacity. See also gravity drag. When passing by a celestial body it means applying thrust when nearest to the body. 
When gradually making an elliptic orbit larger, it means applying thrust each time when near the periapsis. When applying delta v to decrease specific orbital energy, this is done most efficiently if a is applied in the direction opposite to that of v, and again when v is large. If the angle between v and g is acute, for example in a landing on a celestial body without atmosphere and in a transfer to a circular orbit around a celestial body when arriving from outside, this means applying the delta v as late as possible. When passing by a planet, it means applying thrust when nearest to the planet. When gradually making an elliptic orbit smaller, it means applying thrust each time when near the periapsis. If A is in the direction of V, delta E equals V D delta V equals V A D T Display style delta epsilon equals int v d delta v equals int v a d t. Topic: Tangential velocities at altitude. Topic: See also. Specific energy change of rockets. Characteristic energy C3 double the specific orbital energy